Hi, it's Paul Kelly here from the Enable Head Nerd team. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to access the new REST APIs in NCentral. To access the REST APIs, you need to be running NCentral 2023.9 or later. From your NCentral server in the URL bar, we're going to go to forward slash API Explorer, hit on return, and we're going to load into the Swagger interface, which allows us to navigate and understand all the APIs that are currently available to us. As you scroll down here, we can see the different categories of APIs that are currently available within your NCentral instance. Uh, if we click on a category, we can see the different API calls. Get calls are blue, which allow you to extract information from your NCentral server, and post calls are green, which allow you to set information in your NCentral server as well. Before we do any of that though, we need to first authenticate against the APIs and we need to use our JSON web token to do so. We showed you how to do that in a previous video. We're going to come up to our authorize button in here. We're going to enter our JSON web token, click on authorize. We're going to click on close and to complete this process, we need an access token. And we do that by running and executing one of the API calls. So we're going to come down to authentication. We're going to click on authenticate. We're going to click on try it out. We're going to click on execute. And in the response body, we're going to see the access token that we need to complete the authentication. So we're going to make a note of this here. Copy this, scroll back up to our authorize button and enter this into the API access token field. We'll go ahead and click on authorize and we've now authenticated against the REST APIs on your NCentral server. We can now start to extract information from your NCentral server. So if we want to get a list of customers, for example, we can scroll down to our organizational units. We're going to click on our get API customers. In here, we're going to choose to try it out. Now I can choose to sort the customers that I extract, maybe using customer name or customer ID. So I'm gonna enter the sort by field, the category I want to sort by. In my case, I'm gonna use customer ID. Now it is case sensitive, so you need to make sure you enter the exact field that is retrieved by the API call. And I'm gonna sort this in ascending order. We're gonna to choose to execute this. As we scroll down here, we can see in response body all the different customers, lists of customer information from this particular NCentral server. So guys, that's how you access the new REST APIs in NCentral. I hope you found this video useful and hopefully we'll see you on the next one.